یو چاپ سو ورشي او خپل او کیدای شي په باندې بد نه دی خو ما ستاسو سره بچاو سره چا ته لاس نه اچوي موسیقی Thank you so much uh, for having me here. Uh, I would like to first of all thank uh, Fazal Afridi who has organized this protest. Uh, and I, I thank all of you uh, for gathering here, uh, for uh, expressing solidarity with the Pashtun Tahafuz movement, uh, specifically uh, to condemn the arrest of uh, Ali Wazir and other PTM activists. We do know that uh, uh, Sayyid Alim Masood was again, once again, arrested uh, in Pakistan. Uh, we, uh, the, the arrest of uh, Ali Wazir has been wrongful and he's been wrongfully detained and uh, the, the, the cases against him are completely false. Uh, we're, we're seeing that uh, the Pakistani military and the Pakistani government are uh, increasing its and intensifying their crackdown against the Pashtun Tahafuz movement in Pakistan. Uh, many of their activists are in jail besides Ali Wazir and besides uh, Sayyid Alim Masood and other, other many prominent activists. Many of them are not allowed to move from one place to another. Uh, for example, in, recently we saw that uh, when uh, they wanted to, many of their, uh, the Pashtun Tahafuz movement wanted to hold a protest in Khyber Agency. Uh, the uh, military did not allow Manzur Pashtin to go inside uh, Khyber Agency. Uh, we have seen that they are not allowed to go to uh, Koita recently when uh, Sana Ijaz was in Koita, one of the Pashtun Tahafuz movement members. Uh, she was uh, detained in Koita and then expelled uh, from Koita. She had gone to Baluchistan to uh, actually open a library there. Uh, so we are seeing that Pashtun Tahafuz movement is being, uh, it, there is an intensification of attacks against uh, Pashtun Tahafuz movement uh, from the Pakistan army, from the Pakistani government. Uh, and it seems that uh, the, the Pakistani government is not learning or the Pakistani military is not learning from its previous experiences. We've seen that other uh, nationalities in P Pakistan, for example, the, uh, the Baloch, for example, uh, the, the, uh, in the 1970s we saw that with the Bangladeshis, uh, we're seeing that with the uh, uh, Urdu-speaking community, we're seeing that with the Sindhi, Sindhi community. Uh, all of the uh, different nations that uh, exist within Pakistan, uh, they are all uh, raising their voice about, about the suppression. And as they are raising their voice against the oppression that is happening in Pakistan, we're seeing that the, uh, the government and the, the military is responding with more oppression. Uh, so we're seeing uh, that the government has not learned anything, the military the Pakistan army has not learned anything and they're forcing people towards uh, uh, into a corner where uh, you know there might be a violent confrontation. We're seeing that uh, and that that kind of violent confrontation if that happens in the Pashtun lands, if that happens uh, with the, within the Pashtun uh, community that could lead to very dangerous consequences for Pakistan. Uh, that could lead to very dangerous consequences for the stability and the uh, and the uh, peaceful, uh, uh, you know, uh, community that is living within the Pashtun lands. So the Pakistani government, the Pakistani military should realize that the Pashtun Tahafuz movement and the demands of the Pashtuns uh, and the Pashtun Tahafuz movement uh, are just. These demands should be uh, addressed. Uh, Imran Khan, uh, the Pakistani Prime Minister right now, uh, when he was in, uh, uh, not in power, he used to attend Pashtun Tahafuz movement protests. He used to express solidarity with the Pashtun Tapas movement. Uh, he was there standing next to Manzur Pashtin. And ever, ever since he's gotten into power, 
he has totally changed sides. He has joined the Pakistan military establishment. Uh, we plead to the Pakistani government, Pakistani Prime Minister, uh, and the international uh, community uh, that they should look into this, the human rights abuses that the Pakistani military is conducting. Uh, there should be an independent investigation as Manzoor Pashtin himself, I, I, I interviewed him recently, he said uh, that there, is, there should be an independent truth and reconciliation commission that should be set up uh, and they should investigate all the abuses that the Pakistan military has done uh, uh, since 9-11, since war and terror has started, in which the Pashtuns have been terrorized, the Pashtuns have been oppressed, and the Pashtuns are only demanding for their rights. Thank you so much for coming today, and thank you for having me here. جنگ دا پختون پا سیما کی دائی پختانا پا کی وزر کی گی پختانا پا کی اور اصلی پختانا پا کی دیکھو رکی گی پختانا با دیتا کی جگری اصلی عملین نارے والا تا اور پا گو تک دی ملکرو دے باران لوجے پرگرام و پمدیز افایت رسی جی صرف مدر بدل تشوارون اور کی گی آگا کچھے رہو لگا بیتا سے آیا